Hey, and welcome to this video tutorial for Real Popup. Today we're going to look at a LAN messenger called Real Popup, which is going to allow you to communicate with people over your network. So the nice thing about LAN messengers like this Real Popup application we're going to explore today is that there's actually no requirement that you're connected to the internet to use it. You can actually message anyone on your network without internet access. So here's the main page for the actual software. It's realpopup.it. And if you'd like to learn more about it, you can look at the features page here. It has some pretty uh, good information as far as what our application offers. And when you're ready to download the application, you can go to the download page here, and you'll see that there's an EXE and MSA file that you can actually uh, download onto your machine to install the software. I'm going to go ahead and download the EXE file. And we're just going to save that onto my downloads folder. Click on save, and I'm going to go ahead and launch the setup and choose your language and click on OK and then we're going to click on next next and install now once that install completes go ahead and make sure that you click on launch real pop-up and click on finish alright and so now that we've launched our application here you can see you get a small little window that you'll be able to use to communicate with everyone on your LAN network and so I can actually see all of my friends or people that are available to message I can just click on that person and you can see that it's going to bring up a little chat window here where I can communicate with that person directly. So of course I can send a text message. But in addition to just being able to send text messages, you can also transfer files to this person as well. So I can click on send files and I can either browse files or if I want I can even use the drag and drop feature. So in order to use the drag and drop feature, just simply find the file that you want to share and drag and drop it onto your window here. So for example, here I have an image that I want to share with this person on my network, so I can just drag and drop this image right here onto my window. So here you can see that the file actually sends to that person and they'll be able to open it on their end. You'll notice in the top right corner there's some other options here, like I can also add users to the conversation if you want multiple people to be in your chat. Click on this icon to get more information about this particular user. It shows you the particular machine that they're actually accessing and you can see information about their system as well. You can also view the history of this user and if you wanted there's also a desktop sharing option as well in our software. If you've received multiple files from someone you can actually click on this icon here where it says browse received files and you'll be able to see that there's a folder created on your machine with all of the images or items that have been shared with you. So if you ever have lost a file that someone sent to you, you can go back and browse those at any time. So you can see that there are a number of really unique and awesome features that Real Popup offers. And that's just a quick look at our messenger, Real Popup. It's a great way to communicate with friends and family or even within your business on your LAN network. If you haven't already, go ahead and check out the website. Again, it is realpopup.it, and you can download the software for free today. That's it for this video tutorial for Real Popup. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.